I'm not aware of this documentary that, that you point to, but I, what I will say broadly is that there are a number of elements that undergird the global strategic partnership that we have uh, with our Indian partners. One of those additional elements are the values that we share, uh, the values that are common to American democracy and to Indian democracy. Uh, India, of course, is uh, the world's largest democracy. It's a, it's a, it's a vibrant uh, democracy. Uh, and again, um, we look to everything that ties us together. Uh, and we look to reinforce all of those elements that tie us together. Some more breaking news coming in. BBC documentary controversy is only getting bigger. The Kerala uh, DFY FI to show BBC documentary, which is India the Modi Quest and the Democratic Youth Federation of India have said that they will be playing it across Kerala. DFY FI says it's a mark of protest as the government, the Indian government has blocked the documentary. Again, the word to be used is blocked. Links of these documentary have been blocked online. There is no official ban on this documentary. MIB has not said it is a banned documentary. They've just said that they have blocked these links uh, online. So the MIB, and you heard from Kanchan Gupta as well. Now going across to my colleague Ritu, who reports live uh, Neetu, who I'm sorry, uh, beg your pardon, reports live on this. Very good morning to you, Neetu. Neetu, can you tell me about the scheduled screenings of this documentary? How many have been planned already? Uh, see, what the De Democratic Youth Federation of India is saying that across the street, they will be holding these documentaries. So uh, district-wise, it will be done. So, um, so far, the times have not been fixed, but today there will be, in a, at least in a couple of districts, is what we are understanding. And in some universities also, in some districts, uh, uh, they're planning uh, uh, to uh, screen uh, this documentary. So they say it's a mark of their protest because uh, uh, the union government has blocked the links of this, and that is why they have decided to exhibit this in uh, various uh, uh, places. Neetu, is the government keeping track of this? Have they reacted to it? I'm sorry, I didn't under get the question. Is the government keeping a track of these screens? Has the government reacted to it? Because now it is making news. They have publicly announced it. It's going to be held in Kannur. The SFI wing is going to be showing it. The CPM students wing is going to be showing this documentary in Kerala. Has the government reacted to all these proposed screenings across the state? The state government has so far not reacted to this, but uh, what the information that we are getting right now is that uh, MOSB Murli Peren has said that this documentary should not be screened in the state. The chief minister should intervene immediately in this. And he went on to say that these are all allegations which have been uh, rejected by the highest court of the state, the Supreme Court of the country, the Supreme Court. So should uh, Kerala soil be used uh, to uh, propagate against uh, that. Uh, that is what uh, we consider in and has uh, now just asked. He has asked the chief minister to intervene in this and to stop this. 